Thanks. Hello, this is uh, Anton Fikori uh, to discuss uh, carpal tunnel syndrome and examination uh, of uh, the uh, medial nerve. Um, th this gentleman has a history of tingling and numbness mainly involving the radial digits of both hands. He's been symptomatic for approximately one year. has a paresthesia involving radial digits of both hands as well as weakness. As you can see, see here, he has a uh, uh, mild thenar muscle atrophy as well as uh, in this area. The tendon that we want to test the, is the abductor palsy brevis. That's purely innervated by the median nerve. Uh, and that's really the only one you could, that is uh, uh, reliably testable uh, for a, a median nerve problem with the level of the wrist. And the best way to do so is to keep the hand parallel to the ground and ask him to press against the fi uh, our finger. Okay. And uh, he does have uh, weakness. We can compare it to the other side. He has similar mild thenar muscle atrophy. And he, this is a little better. The other thing that I uh, would like to do to test the median nerve is to simply do what's called a compression test. You press uh, about the same level, both sides, and see if they have tingling and numbness within uh, uh, 90 seconds. And then you can report it as a positive compression test after, let's say, 10 seconds, 30, 60, or 90 seconds. Uh, after 90 seconds, then it's negative. Uh, the others that you are familiar with is Tenel, but it's really not uh, very... Uh, uh, accurate, uh, very specific or sensitive, and and uh, lastly is uh, the phalans. I know a lot of people try to press the r wrists against each other dorsally, but really a, a more uh, accurate way of doing so is just to allow gravity to press them down, uh, and then again similar weight uh, and uh, see if they become uh, they develop tingling or numbness and report it to how many seconds, uh, 10, 20, 30, etc. and wait up to uh, 60 seconds. Um, and then also you want to just uh, uh, make sure that uh, they have uh, no other uh, muscle wasting such as a hypothenar or first dorsal uh, compartment. Those are the ulnar nerve and check the ulnar nerve uh, by asking them to abduct the fingers really strong, real strong, strong, keep them apart, keep them apart. That's it. Keep them there. Okay, and strong. Similarly, keep them apart. Okay, Doctor, strong. Okay, very good. Upgrade. And that's it. Uh, continuing on with uh, doing a cortisone injection for uh, a carpal tunnel syndrome. Uh, remember, the median nerve is uh, uh, in line with the radial border of the ring finger. So if I may draw it, this is the median nerve. So our goal is to inject just ulnar to that um, and between the proximal wrist and distal wrist creases. I use a little ethyl chloride and a little alcohol and they're nearly going perpendicular and, and that's it. And then similarly we can do the other side. Okay, very good.